Hey guys, it's me, and today I'm going to be doing a review of the second inform Fabrizio Michele from Palermo. You can see this guy's arm card stats up on the screen right about now. And his average price on the Xbox is 88k, and his average price on the PS3 is 142k, so quite a big difference there. So I'll move on to the in-game stats now. Quite a lot of light green stats there, 93 ball control, 98 curve, 90 dribbling, 93 finishing, 92 free kick accuracy, 94 long shots. 94 penalties, 84 short pass, 95 shot power, 92 follies, high low work rate, 4 star weak foot, 4 star skill moves, 95 acceleration, 97 agility, 99 balance, 90 reactions, 87 sprint speed, and 68 strength, as well as 83 attack positioning and 81 vision. So some pretty good in-game stats there, especially for the price compared to some of the team of the year players, they are very nice. So I'll move on to the gameplay now. And to start off with, his pace is nice, definitely better than the line form, although not a huge amount, but it is noticeable, but again, not a huge amount better. His dribbling is also better than the not in form, and once again, not a huge amount better, but still, it's noticeable, and especially if you're a skiller, you will notice it more. You can see he had ridiculously high balance and agility, which really help him when he's doing skill moves and dribbling in general. And now on to his shooting, which is unfortunate. I don't know what it was about this guy, but you're going to see a load of shots that I missed with him. I mean, I just could not get score at all. And I don't know what it was. He just seemed to be unlucky, or just put it off target, or, I don't know, just could not score. And he only scored a few times in a lot of games. It wasn't like I didn't try with him. I did have a lot of games with him, and unfortunately, I just could not seem to score. And it was quite disappointing because with the non inform I seemed to score a lot of goals. And I think I'll put a clip in right about now. I played one game with the non inform and I scored a goal with him. And it was the kind of goal I was expecting every game from the second inform. It was a finesse shot from outside the box, sort of dipping and curving around the goalkeeper. And that's what the non inform does every game for me. But for me, this guy just did not seem to produce the goods. His skill moves and weak foot are both nice. Although, like I said, he just seemed to be somewhat unlucky. So his left foot obviously did not put very many goals away. But yeah, his shooting was definitely the biggest letdown for me. 91 shooting, I expected him to finish a lot of chances. Not absolutely everything, but I expected him to be somewhere near the level of Ibra. But, I don't know. You can see from the clips, I had a lot of shots with him from all areas of the pitch. And he just would not put the ball away. And I am playing on assisted shooting, so it's not like I have to do very much, just aim towards one corner of the goal and hold down the power button for a bit. And really, it was just quite frustrating not to be able to score with him. One thing I will say, this guy is actually pretty decent at cam. He's got pretty good long shots, again, unlucky not to score, but he did come pretty close. And I'd say if I was slightly more skilled, or maybe if I just got a bit more luck, then I would have scored quite a few more long shots. So he can be quite good at cam, but for me, his finishing was not clinical enough. So I'll move on to the verdict now, and I'm going to give this guy a 7 out of 10, at least if you play him at strike, only because of his shooting. I mean, that's a big thing that lets him down, obviously. His heading is very good, but you don't buy him for his heading. And with 91 shooting, you expect him to put away a lot of chances, and he just did not seem to do that for me. Again, this is my opinion, and he's going to play differently for different people. But for me, he was just quite a big letdown, and pretty unfortunate, but you saw from the clips... Hopefully you've enjoyed this review, if it's been helpful please leave a like and suggest a player for the next review in the comments and I'll talk to you all next time.